on. I need it for the next segment. Albert. Boy. Thank you. All right, everyone. I'm excited because now we're going to make my favourite animal. Can you guess what that is, Albert? Oh, yeah. I bet it's worms. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> it's not worms. We saw it at the beginning of the show. It's an elephant. Oh, cool. With big ears and a long nose. Yes. Well, I'm going to blow up my elephant right now and you need to blow it a fair old way up probably almost to the end there's not a lot of room left but just let a little puff out so that you've got a bit more flexibility in the balloon okay wow. now let's tie it off okay around the back and then over Headbutt, Albert, oh. as you go. <laughs> <laughs> sorry Albert okay now Albert what do elephants have what's the big long part at the front of an elephant that's right or a trunk and we're going to make a very long trunk on this elephant so around about that looks like quite a long trunk yeah, don't you think? That's a great trunk. now because he's got such a long nose elephants also have something else don't they Albert oh yeah they have really big ears right so we're not going to make our normal ear we're going to actually make a little bow like this so if you bow the balloon over a bit like we did with the poodle, if you've been to that section already. And then just give it a twist, like so, okay? And a second bow for his other ear, like so, okay? Penny, yeah. they have really big legs too. Well, they do, but this is a baby elephant, okay? So we've got our baby elephant now, and we're going to give him just a little neck, like so, okay? And there is one of his front legs, another front leg, and there we go. There's his front legs, and he's got his his little trunk and his big ears. <laughs> so that's the three the three bubbles as with the other animals. The Absolutely, animals. same same bubbles. Okay, it's just the front part that's a little bit different. Mm. Now, don't give him too big a body because it is only a baby elephant. Alrighty. And we don't want to frighten Albert. And there's another one of his legs, okay? And then see here, I've run out of balloon, yeah. but I haven't because if you just give it a little twist, you oh. can give him a little button tail, okay? And we'll give that a twist like so, okay? Wow. And there oh, we have, oh, he's upside yeah. down. We have our cute little he's elephant. gorgeous. Shall we put eyes on him, Albert? Oh, yeah, he needs eyes, Daddy. Okay, well, I'll grab... Grab the marker and we put some little eyes. He's only a little baby, but he's yeah. very cute. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and a little mouth. And because he's only a baby, we'll just give him just two little, little tusks. tusks. Not very big ones, because he'll get bigger <laughs> as he grows older. And well, there is your elephant. Yeah, I now, think his, his trunk is definitely the biggest part of him, isn't oh, it? Oh, he's got a very big trunk. Now, Kate, you hold on to oh, our little elephant. You. He's got That's a huge favorite. trunk, just looking at that. He's really cute. Now, I'm going to make something special. A special little friend I'm sure will be great fun for our little elephant. Now, because he's only little, I'm only going to make a little friend, okay? So, Albert, have a look at this over here. Look at this. I've got just a little pink balloon here, and I'm just going to tie it off. Okay, and let's see what I can make. Let's see here. I've got a nose, not a very big one, and just a little ear, and maybe a little ear, like so. When they're little, the balloons are a little bit fiddly, okay? So as you're practicing and getting better, you might like to try using slightly more air than this, but, oh look, I've lost the side there. We're going to join those together. Now watch this, okay, Albert? I'm going to show you a little trick. Take the balloon for his ear between your two fingers and in both hands and give that a little twist. And look what happens. Look what oh. happens, Albert. Can you see that? Yeah. What's that look a little bit like? Oh, shh. don't say anything. Squeak, squeak. Because we don't want to frighten our little elephant friend. So now we want to make a little neck and his two front feet like so. And he's so tiny you can barely see this little animal in in my hand, but he's awfully cute. And here we go. We're going to give him another bubble, and we need two more little bubbles, and we're almost done. And one more little bubble. And join that together. Squeak, squeak, squeak. 
And look what we've made, a little pet mouse. He's a little mouse. Do you think mice like elephants? Squeak, 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 squeak. We'll see you later. Yeah.